Hello, thank you for joining me today. This is Becky Stampin' Daily, and we're going to be making a fall card today. This card is a special fall card. It's very simple. And we're using the Beauty Friendship stamp set to do this piece of ground here under the tree. And we're using the Sparkle of the Season stamp set for the greeting. Thankful for you. We're going to be using the Scallop Contours dies. And we're using this size scallop die. You need a piece of basic white cardstock as a scrap to cut this out. We're going to be using the Beauty of the Trees dies. Beautiful Trees dies. I got mis mixed up with the DSP. And we're using this die for the foliage and this die for the tree. You're going to take your tree after you cut it out with your die and you're going to run it through the Tasteful Textile 3D folder to give it some dimension. We'll be using soft suede cards, soft suede ink and Cajun Craze ink and we'll also be using the brush metallic adhesive backed dots. Your sizes are, you need a piece of basic white that's a scrap to cut out with the die. You need a piece of Cajun Craze that's eight and a half by five and a half. You're going to score it at two and one eighth and score it again at four and a quarter. You're gonna fold it over on the four of a quarter. And then you're going to fold the two and an eight score backwards, back. And there it is. He's not laying down very good. So we have a piece of Beauty of the Earth DSP that's five and a quarter by four, which is going to go right here. We have a piece of Beauty of the Earth DSP that's one and seven eighths by five and a quarter that's going to go right here. I'll put those on in a minute. Oh, we're also using, oh my goodness, I forgot the dies. I'll be right back, hold on. We're also using the seasonal swirls dies for the pumpkin and the leaves. There's a pumpkin in here and there is these two leaves and that's what we'll be using for this. Sorry about that. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to take our tree and we're going to put some soft suede on a sponge dauber. Stamp it off because you don't want it real dark. And just rub this on here to give it a little bit of color change in places where it's not just you don't really need to do the top because it's going to be completely covered with the foliage there then you're going to take your Tombow and use this very sparingly because out fast. I'm going to use my silicone craft sheet and put this on here. Just, you don't need a lot. You really don't have to do the whole thing. Just a little dot here and there and some of the bigger areas.
That oh, should be good enough. And you're going to pick it up and put it on here. really isn't a right or wrong way to do that. It's a tree. Now just because these annoy me, I cut these little tips off. There it is. So the next thing we're going to do is attach this. Um, I think I'm gonna stamp my greeting first so I don't, and the little ground part so I don't get this out of whack when I go to put the tree on. So, This is the ground thing. It goes like this. I'm just going to put it right here, right above this stitched area. Okay. And then the thankful for you is stamped with Cajun Craze. the tree. I'm going to get some of this small dimensionals. And put them on the trunk of the tree. And cut this one in half. here. What I did. And I'll just put a couple up here. This doesn't have to be completely down. Just cut a couple in half and stick them here and there. I should have done this ahead of time so I didn't take up so much time on these videos. I gotta be careful they get so long and uh, let's do one more. Let's do one over here. There we go. Get the nose off. Come on. My goodness. Okay, finally. Okay, so we're going to put this right in the center of the dirt area. 
center of it. And that's perfect. So this doesn't have to be, it's fine the way it is. Then the next thing we're gonna do is we cut out with the seasonal, seasonal swirls dies. I'm sorry, I'm not organized today. We cut out a pumpkin with pumpkin pie and Cajun craze. We cut out a leaf with old olive and mossy meadow. So we'll put those on. The leaves are on with glue dots and the pumpkins are on with dimensionals. Olive goes on the pumpkin pie. And the mossy meadow goes on the Cajun craze. Okay. And then we're going to put a um, dimensional under them. This one. Then we're using the brush metallic adhesive backed dots. These are perfect for fall. And I'm using the copper colored ones. They come in three colors. Put this here. this down here. Okay, all we have left to do is put the DSP on. This is my last fall card. There's so many pretty ones to make. Christmas cards made. This just goes in the center of this. We have a big sale going next week, the 16th, 17th, and 18th of November. All card stock is going to be, I believe, 10% off ink pads. Uh, now that I'm talking about it, I can't remember. I shouldn't have said anything. All cardstock in the annual catalog, ink pads, and a selection of dies are on sale, but I can't remember the exact amount. Now, all you have left is to put this on here, and when you put it on, you have to be sure that you only put, I put this down with hair and tape, but you don't want to do the whole back, you just want to do this side. stuff. So easy to use and it sticks like glue. The last video I made, I was doing stuff 
down where y'all couldn't see, and I've got to make sure it doesn't happen again. I stay up here in that area. Okay. Now, you're going to put this on here. Center it. And put it over. About that far. And then just rub that tape in. And there you have it. Beautiful fall card. Thank you for joining me today. The uh, instructions for this card and the supplies will be on my blog. I'm also going to do a video on it that I just did that will be on my YouTube channel. And my blog is stampindaily.blogspot.com and if you want to place an order it's beckyburkowski.stampinup.net be sure and check the sale on November the starts November 16th because when you get low on cardstock and I still have so many of the old school ink pads I'm going to replace a bunch of mine and it's a great sale on the dies so hope to see you soon when I have another video thank you